Got a nice red emperor here this time where we're going to uh, quickly fill it up. And uh, also arguably one of your best eaten reef fish as well, the coral trout, red emperor. Uh, have to be one of the one of the favourites of the reef. We caught that one, Greg? Yeah, I definitely did get this one. <laughs> Possession's nine tenths of the law, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> you, haven't, you haven't caught one yet, have you? Oh, he has got a knife, guys. <laughs> <laughs> no, just sharp, just sharp. It's a big call. Yeah, no, it's, it's only early. 60 miles out in the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> Where anything can happen. Yeah, pretty easy. Red, red amber just cutting through along the back of the fish. Cutting what along. The backbone there, the and we'll just cut up here and <laughs> cut up over the ribs. That's it. Yeah, no wastage there at all. Going like a pro, Lee. I mean, when you do get these bigger fish, sometimes cut the wings out. The wings are good eating the pictorial section of the fish. Scissors very good for that. Yeah, these scissors are great. Make sure you've got a nice cold beer handy. Definitely essential. You've got to keep the fluids up. Come around, big fella. Yeah, big fillets, and as you can see there, that nice white flesh. As, um, awesome. As good as cold fish. Yeah. I wouldn't know. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> keep trying, mate, one day. Okay, excellent. Okay, yeah, just doing the other side now. And uh, a bit later on, we'll can't skin reef fish um, at sea. But um, once again, get the knife and just work down along the, the skin of the fish. Leave your scales on, makes it easier. And then you can, big chunky fish like this, slice into smaller portions. Into nice, good serving sizes. That's a good red when you've got a bevel of foot. Yeah. Yeah, best way though, your bigger reef fish cut up over the, the rib bones, it just saves your knives. You don't lose that much flesh and um, a bit easier. There you go, two oh, nice refillets. Bit, bit of practice. Yeah, if you're um, too easy.